Today, Rockstar revealed a teaser trailer on Twitter, and this is more than likely a teaser for that new location and the new heist DLC that's coming soon. And we all knew that a new location was coming, but we didn't know what it was until now. So, if anyone was hoping for Liberty City or North Yankton, eh, you know, as cool as those would have been, it looks like that's not gonna be it. And for those of you who were hoping for San Fierro or Las Venturas, I mean, I don't think Rockstar would have ever considered doing an actual full new city for just a DLC. But it looks like they're doing some kind of island, I think, because these places are definitely not in GTA V's map. Let's take a look at them. There's a watchtower, another watchtower, some very fancy and expensive looking cliffside villas, a farm, and I don't think this is a farm that exists in the map already, I don't recognize as many palm trees around it, another shot of what I presume is the same farm in which it appears to be very close to the sea, and then a final shot that is in Los Santos, it's of a body labeled as John Doe, who was last at the airport in Los Santos and his main affiliation is with El Rubio, which this dossier is named after. So yeah, this is our new location. Like I said, it seems to be some kind of island location. There are islands off the coast of Southern California in real life. You have the Channel Islands, which includes Catalina Island. Now, I don't know if there are farms and watchtowers like this on Catalina Island in real life, but I know that they have a town section. There's stuff for tourists to do. But this doesn't really look like much of a touristy location. And I wonder now where off the map this is going to be located then. I almost thought that maybe it could have been like Guarma in Red Dead 2, where it's located someplace really far away from where the main game is set, and it would be impossible to fly or take a boat to it on your own. But then there is this shot of what appears to be a map at the beginning here. It flashes by very quickly. This location probably will be somewhere off the map itself. And on the top right portion of this map, it kind of looks like there's a little airport or airstrip of some kind, so I guess we can fly there, if that wasn't already obvious. By the way, I don't know about you, but to me, the visuals kind of give off an espionage or government agent vibe, doesn't it? Like if this trailer is being accessed through a government computer or something. Well, Rockstar really seemed to like these types of stories that involve government agents, spies, espionage. They should make a full game based around it sometime. And this is purportedly going to involve a heist of some kind, so now I wonder exactly what it's going to be about. So what are your thoughts on this? Are you interested in this DLC in the new location? Did you want it or expect it to be something else and now you're disappointed? Let me know. But, uh, you really shouldn't be disappointed. I mean, why is GTA 6 even trending on Twitter? Did people really see this and think GTA 6? Did word not get out enough that there was going to be a major GTA Online update? Because we've known about this for quite some time. Or do people just like to forget this kind of stuff? I mean, hey, Rockstar can't say they didn't tell us about this.